As we continue our golf prep, we'll be working into the wrist. Of course, the wrists are extremely important to not only holding good golf stance, but also making sure that we have the motion available as we go into our backswing, as we strike that ball, and as we follow through. The wrists, of course, are very important, so we wanna make sure we have adequate motion, not only in flex and extension, but also with rotation. So this one will address flex and extension. We'll be going from a neutral grip. We call this the hinge. You can grab a shorter stick. You can start grabbing it towards kind of middle stick here, hand roughly directly out from the shoulder. I'm gonna grab that stick over the top. I got my thumb over my fingers. I wanna make sure I keep all my fingers in contact with the stick the whole time. Make sure I just get a good base, and then I will just work flexion in each direction. So I would just pull up, go as high as I can, point that stick forward, go as far forward as I can, under control. We're getting wrist here, we're getting forearm, get some elbow, we're getting a little shoulder, we're tying it all in together, making sure we have strength and control in each direction there. One thing, like I said, we wanna make sure we keep the fingers in contact. Make sure as we go up, fingers aren't losing it here or losing it here. We just wanna really keep contact there so we can gain that strength and motor control with a full grip, working up and back down. If you wanna increase the difficulty, slide that hand a little bit lower. Now you got less leverage. We're here, everything else is the same. Working back and forth, you wanna make it a little bit easier. Slide yourself down. Now we are working here. It's gonna be a little bit more challenging this direction as I work from here, right? Because now I have less leverage going this direction. So easier here, harder there, right? So it's the same opposite direction this way, right? A little bit harder now, I got a control there. As I come up, now the weight is coming this way, it's a little bit easier. So you can vary the difficulty of the movement by where you place your hand on the stick. Just really work to keep all five fingers on that stick and work just through that wrist. That is wrist hinges, work through all your reps, prescribed reps or just time on the first side. Switch sides, same thing on the other wrist. Those are wrist hinges using a short stick.